Alright, sounds good, Chris. And Mardi Gras is less than one month away, but with many parades and parties on hold for the year, you may be wondering about another way to celebrate locally. News 13's Mackenzie McClintock might have a few ideas for us this morning. She is live from the Bagel Maker with more. Hey, Mackenzie. Hey, Erin, good morning. Bringing everybody a sweet story here to start your Friday. Thanks to Jim Hayden and the bagel maker. And he's actually rolling out some dough and working on some king cakes for us this morning here in his location. Jim, so excited that you're making those king cakes again for everybody to order this year. Talk a little bit about the process you're going through right now. Um, I can't hear you. I have a mask on. That's a joke. <laughs> that's, a, that, that's a horrible joke. Sorry if I sound muffled. I'm the Swedish chef today. So we're making king cakes. We make our own praline. praline. We're going to make that in an, another segment of this show this morning. But right now we're rolling out a king cake. This one happens to be a cream cheese king cake. So we do a cream cheese filling and then I'm also going to put our actual praline and then I'm going to top it with uh, pecans as well. Okay, yummy. So a lot of that sounds pretty traditional too, especially that cream cheese though. It can be a different type of variety. So what are all the varieties that people can order this year to celebrate Mardi Gras? Well, you can do fillings, most of your regular pie fillings, your apple, your cherry, your stuff like that. Um, and you can do a cream cheese. You can do a flavor cream cheese as well. Um, they're all additional. Uh, obviously, they're tw 27 for the for the this size, which will feed about 20 people comfortably. And then it's three dollars more for cream cheese, three dollars more for a flavor and three dollars more for a flavor cream cheese. So it's kind of goes up, but you can get pretty much whatever you want in it um, within reason. Okay. Nuts and bolts. We, we don't do that. Yeah, it works for me. Let's, of course, talk to rich flavor for King Cake's rich history, too. So talk a little bit about the tradition for you guys, though, of being able to make these every year for people and just how the community always responds to what you guys are doing here. So, so this whole thing started with my wife. Um, I love her dearly, and I was lazy. And she said, hey, why don't you make king cakes? They're really popular, and nobody gets them in Panama City. I'm like, no, 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 we'll be all right. We make bagels. And she's like, no, really? And after about two years of uh, uh, reminding me, let's put it that way, uh -huh. reminding me, uh -huh. she went out and she bought a king cake recipe, one of the box ones, at the World Market. She says, you got to make this. So I made it, and then I got with some of my baker friends, and we started swapping stories, and then we created a recipe, and then we revamped it, and we've revamped it about five times before we got to this. Okay. And now that we've got this, this is a really good product. We love it. Um, and uh, it's from scratch, so we can make them in June, we can make them in September, we can make as many as you want now. We just need 48 hours notice though, we got to have 48 hours notice because we are a from scratch bakery. Everything we do is small batch to include our bagels and breads, so we want to be your baker, and but we want to have what you want. Yeah. So okay. back to the tradition, it's a praline filling, like I said, we're going to do that in a little bit. It's got pecans on it, um, so it's a nice sweet dough, nice fluffy. Um, and it, it's been around a long time. Yeah, I love it. And it's something that I tried actually for the first time when we met last year. I'd never had king yes. cake before, and I can definitely say it's delicious. Sugary, sweet, and everything you need to celebrate Mardi Gras, hopefully in a safe way this year. All right, let's send it back over to the studio, guys. We're going to add some filling to these cakes when you see us next time.